Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on factors, multiples, primes and composites. As always, a special puzzle to warm up the brain cells is on the next slide. The answer will be given at the end. Enjoy. What is the meaning of the following? Good luck with it and see how you go. Factors. Factors of a given number divide evenly into that number. For example, what are the factors of 12? The answer, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 12. Why? Because they all divide evenly into 12. Multiples. The multiples of a given number are numbers which are all greater than or equal to the given number. The given number divides evenly into its multiples. For example, write down all the multiples of 4. Now here, 4 is the given number. The answer, 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24 and 28 and so on. Why? Because 4 divides evenly into all of them and the answers continue forever as indicated by the dots. Note, if you were asked for the first five multiples of 4, just write down those numbers only. For example, the first five multiples of 4 are just those ones. Primes or prime numbers. A prime number is one which has only two different factors. This is very very important and please don't forget it. Here is an important note. One is not a prime number because it does not have two different factors. The smallest prime number is two it is the only even prime number. For example, the list of prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13 and so on. Note, the list of prime numbers continues forever. Composites or composite numbers. Composite numbers are those which have at least three different factors. Example, the list of composite numbers are 4, 6, 8, 9, 10, 12, 14 and so on. Why are they composite numbers? because all of these numbers have three or more numbers that divide into them evenly. Note, the list of composite numbers continues forever because of the dots. A quick quiz. Now have a go at these five questions and feel free to check through the video any time you want if you need assistance or clarification. Now here is the puzzle we saw at the beginning. What is the meaning of the following? And the answer, crossroads. I think you would have got that one out. And here are the answers to the quick quiz and as always please check through the video to clarify anything. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe on the next slide and you will receive a notification as to when the next video is available. Hope to see you next lesson.